In this episode, we will talk about physics in revenue management, applications of the quantum harmonic oscillator. Let's enjoy it! Revenue is in general the income of any organization. It is very important for the operation of a company. For this reason, all the industry intend to increase the revenue as much as possible. Let's make a basic example about revenue. If we go to the industry of hamburgers, when we sell always the same type of hamburger, the calculation of the revenue would be very simple. The maximal possible revenue would be the price of the product multiplied by the demand. Thanks, Erika. In fact, if we go to the Cartesian plane, with the x-axis representing the price and the y-axis representing the demand, then the maximal possible revenue for a single product would be equal to the area of the yellow rectangle, namely the price multiplied by the demand. But how can an organization increase the revenue? What changes are necessary? Hey Porky, don't eat too much, man! Each customer has his or her own taste. What should I eat? Let me see. It is in this way that the companies apply what is called market segmentation, which basically consists in offering the same product but with some upgrades or minor changes. By doing minor changes to the product, they can offer it at different prices. Then, for example, a cheeseburger can be offered at a higher price than an ordinary hamburger. They are just the same product, but they will appear in the menu as different products with different prices. Then each customer, depending on his or her taste, will select a different type of hamburger. It has been proved that market segmentation increases the revenue. Thanks, Erika. In fact, the total revenue increases when we have market segmentation. With market segmentation for the products, the total maximal revenue would be equal to the sum of the area of the squares appearing in the figure. Note that in this particular case, the higher the price of the product is, the lower would be its demand. When the customers feel that the offer products are mostly the same, most of them will select naturally the cheapest one. In such situations, the price-demand relation would follow a harmonic oscillator pattern. Then, in most of the cases, since the customers mostly look for the cheapest prices, the higher the price of a product is, the lower will be its demand and vice versa. The lower the price, the higher the demand. This pattern can be perceived on the figure and it is a typical harmonic oscillator behavior. One industry where this typical behavior appears is in the aviation industry. Airlines also apply market segmentation for increasing their revenue. Market segmentation in airlines corresponds to dividing the tickets in different classes. A second class ticket, for example, is cheaper than a first class ticket. The second class ticket then has more demand, naturally. But at the end, all the passengers have the same basic service, namely the basic transportation and perhaps some basic meal. They will look at the same sky anyway. The mathematical problem in revenue management in airlines, for the case where we have two classes, is to know when the company should stop selling second class tickets, which are the cheapest in this case, before starting to sell the first class tickets. The price demand variables obey the dynamic of the quantum harmonic oscillator. Thanks, Erika. Indeed. The price demand variables together obey the dynamic of the quantum harmonic oscillator Hamiltonian. In a semi-classical treatment, the phase space, namely the plot of the demand and the price variables, would follow the contour of an ellipsoid. In this way, the problem of maximizing the revenue becomes to be a geometrical problem. Note that each ticket class would correspond to one dimension of the oscillator. The revenue management problem in this case would be to find what is the largest possible rectangle which could be circumscribed inside a ellipse for each class, taking into account that each class is a projection of the ellipsoid over a plane. 
In summary, market segmentation is the key of the success of many companies. It helps to increase the total revenue in many organizations. Market segmentation can be applied in any product if we know what are the type of upgrades. Finally, market segmentation can be modeled with a multidimensional quantum harmonic oscillator. If you liked this video, please give us a like, share the link, and subscribe to the channel. More videos are coming very soon. Continue with us.